today got uh, some interesting games to so have a look short while we will be going to the lessons basically i think you all play like a basic opening which is a uh, dico piano uh, other opening which is called rai lepas this is a basic i think most of you was playing um, queen uh, sorry king pawn and some of you was playing queen pawn king pawn is always is like a attacking attacking player those are play with a e4 was attacking player those was playing with the uh, queen pawn they are the player was a slowly develop and try to attack okay uh, first move e4 e5 knight f3 knight c6 bishop c4 okay what opening is this this is your normal opening I think most of you can recognize this pattern of the opening, right? Wow, great, good job. Everybody recognize the pattern of line, okay? Then bishop c5. Now I'm going to change totally about different game, which is normally we all play, right? Okay, basically what you all play on this position, if you are after bishop c5, what you all play? Yeah, great. Everybody, your game about the Gico Piano is, another name of the Gico Piano is, is an Italian game. Good job. But I got a question here. When you play on this position, if you white player, what do you play? Basically, what do you play? What do you think on the, this position, if you are a white player, the best choice of the game? I can see your plan. Really, you all got plan this moment. I will move this move, and I want to know what if you black play on this plan. B four. Did you see this plan before? Anyone? Anyone got, got play this position on when you play on the tournament? B four. Anyone can see. When you play on the tournament or you play in a tournament, anyone doing this B4 move or you play with them with the B4 move, what the line is this this is. So I got see some of you, some of the students are play against overseas students. I got see the overseas student was play B4 and they was taking the pawn. They was taking the pawn. And from the Giko piano eventually turn what? From Giko Piano, eventually after B4, the total entire game was changing name. Is it free pawn? That's a question mark for me. Yeah. Why giving free pawn B4? You think trap? Why suddenly the white player was giving B4? The first question mark on your mind. Why B4? What's entire plan for the white? Even not start, just the move number, just move number four. So this is called even gambit. It's if you see anyone give a free pawn, it's not free pawn. You want to take the center. That's the total idea of the. You want to take the center. That's the total idea. All all this move want to take the center they, they want to take the center these are the ideas basically you want to give this pawn bishop take and the c3 the move you give free pawn you will be surprised on the game after this you're going to watch her eh? And uh, C3 was played, let's say Bishop go back, and the center was the most strong. You have played center pawn, you see now. And pawn take. Look at the center, who's controlling more center? Who 
Who was controlling more center? Who was controlling more center? Just look at to look into B4. Why they give the B4? The reason of B4 is white one when applies the center. Okay. Basically, that's the idea. Here, white already losing two pawn. Most of the events can be they will be losing B pawn, C pawn. Okay, the white player will be losing B pawn and also C pawn. And this position can see like white was a down one pawn. In this position, down one pawn. This is a different idea, sir. Look at here. The E pawn was given by black white was giving b pawn and c pawn so the c file and then b file is clearly open file 